The State Board of Education released its yearly school grades report today, and we have a breakdown of how the schools here in Allen County fared. As our Sarah Wagner reports, some schools in the area improved, but several also saw grades decline. Sarah? Mark, the A to F grading system has been used for the past two years, and local school leaders have a mix of reactions to the results. Here's the breakdown of the numbers for the four school districts in Allen County. Fort Wayne Community Schools earned 8 A's, 7 B's, 20 C's, 13 D's, and 1 F. East Allen County Schools got 3 A's, 6 B's, and 6 C's. Southwest Allen County Schools earned 5 A's, 2 B's, and 2 C's. And Northwest Allen County Schools received 6 A's and 4 B's. There were also 5 schools classified as failing. Four are chartered or private, and one is an FWCS school. SWCS says the grade for Shawnee Middle came as no surprise, and there are plans already in place to improve that school. It didn't take these letter grades for us to know that we needed to put some, some additional supports in place at, at Shawnee. And so that's something that we, we are working on. Um, it's something that we will continue to work on. The State Board of Education says the school grading system holds schools and corporations to higher standards and provides a more accurate picture of student performance. This year's scores are calculated based on former state school superintendent Tony Bennett's grading formula, but the board is working on changing that for next year. You may remember the scandal involving Bennett and an Indianapolis charter school. Bennett altered that school's grade, moving it from a C to an A. This year, that school received an F. The new system will go into effect starting with the 2014-2015 school year. Well, FWCS says the current report I mean, is an important okay. measure, but they also use their own system to judge performance and success. But some school leaders are pleased with this year's results. East Allen County Schools Superintendent points to several different factors for their success and improvement. The data meetings that we have, the professional development we um, have for our uh, teachers, the fact that parents can look on um, our website, see the curriculum, the parents can monitor the grades of their students, they can log in daily and see how their students are doing. The fact that we're being proactive, not reactive. Moving forward, FWCS leaders say their focus is not so much on the letter grade, but more on the instruction and individual student. And if you'd like to see your child's school grade, you can head over to Wayne.com for a full list of schools in the state. And that report not only includes grades from this year, but also the past two years. Okay, Sarah Wagner tonight. Thanks. We appreciate it.